Results of Phase 2 and Phase 3 clinical trials on the effectiveness of mTOR inhibition in bolstering the aging immune system against respiratory illnesses were inconclusive. As has become especially apparent during the COVID-19 pandemic, respiratory illnesses are a major cause of death in people aged 65 years and over. Immunosenescence almost certainly plays an important role in this increased vulnerability. The trials were conducted at multiple sites, randomized, double-blinded, and placebo-controlled to maximize the quality of data. The trial participants were given the mTOR inhibitor RTB101 in winter during the influenza season for a 16-week period. In the Phase 2 trial, a daily dosage of 10 mg of just RTB101 significantly reduced laboratory confirmations of respiratory infections, but not in smokers or people with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, or COPD. Prior to the launch of the Phase 3 trial, the FDA requested a change in the primary endpoint. Instead of laboratory confirmation of a respiratory infection, the FDA wanted to assess the number of participants who had at least one symptom of an infection. RTB 101 did not significantly reduce the proportion of patients with symptoms of a respiratory infection in the Phase 3 trial. However, RTB 101 induced significantly greater expression of antiviral genes in both trials. RTB 101 was also found to be safe in both trials. The researchers suggest that further refinement of the patient population and the trial endpoints, for example, to assess antiviral gene upregulation, might be necessary to determine whether the change in gene expression can decrease the incidence of severe viral infections in the elderly.